Hello ladies, this is Jennifer again. I have a mini album to show you. Um, I use the Simple Stories Generations paper collection. Um, my only problem with, it's beautiful. This the, the colors are perfect. It's just that there's not a lot of papers that you can use as base pages. Almost, like majority of the paper is for cutouts to embellish the pages. I'm gonna show you in the mini album. Here it is. I used um, the Joann's. I, I bought this three ring binder at Joann's a while back. Um, it's craft colored, as you can see over there. I'm going to put a title. This is the front um, of the book, of the mini album. I'm going to put a title here. When I have my photos, there's the spine and there's the back. Um, here's the first page. Um, and because I didn't have a lot of papers to use as base pages, I had to use other paper collections. This is a Prima ledger paper um, that I had to use. And I'll point out um, other papers that do not belong to the Generations uh, Simple Stories paper collection. Um, this is a paper bag album. It's, it's bigger than your usual paper bag album. I got it at work. Um, they were throwing it out, so I had, I just took them so it's a pocket there's a pocket here like your usual paper bag album big picture here um four by six and then you can embellish around the picture this doesn't have a pocket this is the back of the paper bag i can put a small you know four by six photo here and then these are five by seven cutouts so when i have pictures i'll know what to do with these whether it be journaling journaling um, spots or uh, photo mats another pocket and each uh, page has an insert so like that and then another page for maybe two four by six and or one five by seven another pocket here and of course another insert here and then um, this is a prima another prima ledger paper I had to make this because I needed more space for um, not, I needed more space for photos and these a four by six photo can go on there. So magnetized. So there are a lot of cutouts. Um, and then another uh, pocket. And then this is an accordion that I just tied. and then I'm gonna put. Uh, four by six photo here and then just the cutouts there's so many cutouts that I had to make this waterfall so that I can utilize the cutouts but beautiful paper um, let me just show you all the other and this is the back page and again the back let me just show you the cut cards I'm sure most of you know what this is this is like a three by four and these are the vertical um, cutouts, vertical cutouts. So I group them into verticals and horizontals. I used the horizontals already, horizontal cutouts. These are journaling spots and I group them too. So, and then um, here are some more cutouts. See, and then borders. And then stickers, cardstock stickers that I can use to my. So when I have, uh, here's another one, cardstock stickers. Um, when I have photos, when I have the photos that I want to put in this album, I'll just use all of these cutouts to embellish. And then this is like an overlay. It's a group of overlay. So like this. Okay, here we go. That's it. Thank you, ladies. Bye-bye.